Hey, where do you think you're going? I mean, we still have unfinished business, right? Now, snap out of it and let's get going. Fine. Sheesh, I was trying to think up an intro. Chill, chill down, man. Anyway, hey guys and gals, I'm Pal and welcome back to Wakami. Last episode, we entered Kamiki. We we went through we went through the spirit gate and somehow ended up in Kamiki across the ocean in Nippon. So we're going to be exploring a uh, Kamiki this episode to find out what's going on. Okay, um, let's examine this. This sapling. I don't remember that being here. Hey, isn't this where Sakuya's tree was? What's this dinky little seedling doing here? Weird. Hmm? Wait a second. Wait a second. You're some kind of god, aren't you? I'm a wood sprite. They call me Shakuya. Young wood sprite. Shakuya. What'd she say her name is? Shakuya? Sounds kinda familiar. Anyway, where in the world's Sakuya's tree? Shakuya, that's me! Yeah, yeah, we know, kiddo. We grown-ups are busy right now. Why don't you go off and play? Excuse me, God. Are you looking for me? Did you say God? Hmm, I guess the innocent eyes of a child can see the truth, Ami. Ama? Ama, Mr. Bug and me. Shakuya. Let's be friends, okay? Mr. Bug? You better watch it, kiddo. Ama, when did you get to Kamiki Village anyway? I knew it! We are in Kamiki! We better have a look around, Furball. Okay, she says the same thing. Oh, I love the song! It's so adorable! It's so cute! I love it! Wait. Oh, it gets louder if I zoom in! Oh, it's so adorable. Look at her. Look at her. Do you know who she is, guys? I'm not going to say in case you don't know, but... Wait! Music! Music! Wait, it's back. Okay. No, it's it's gone. Wait. Wait. So, skip, skip past the text. There, the music's back. Look at her. She's so cute! Okay, I'll stop gushing because she's she's so cute. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and um, equip the water tablet because I'm going to go and jump down here. Whoa. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. There are people here if we turn back and go the opposite way. I did not know that. This is our, our little seedling. We're looking after it. It's going to grow really, really big. And one day, it'll be a guardian god, watching over all Nippon. Sis, this god's got something weird on its back. Oh yeah, what a- wow, what beautiful markings. Huh? You mean to tell me that you can see this furball's true form? Indeed they can. Do you live around here, Wolf? We decided to- we wanted to plant a guardian tree in Nippon. So we set off on a trip with the seedlings of this Konohana tree. The Konohana trees are revered as a sacred guardian where we're from. Wherever it grows, happiness grows with it. And we heard Nippon was a place of sadness, so... I'll be happy if our Konohana tree helps even a bit. And the Aaron's village is so clean and pure. I'm sure it'll grow into a beautiful big tree. Oh wow, I didn't know these people were here. On my playthrough, all after talking to Shakuya, I would just leave. Oh my word, that that means so much, story-wise. Like that. Oh my word. I, I'm going to I'm going to hold off my feelings until until the game points it out. But for those of you who who play this game, oh man. Also, Golden Gate for whatever reason. Why is there a Golden Gate here? This. Oh my word, the chills. The chills. I mentioned last episode, you need to pay attention to what happens in the story very closely, and... Oh! Free praise, okay. <laughs> and it's true. Can we please... Thank you, okay. I was like, is Bloom, is Bloom not working? No, it's working. It just... I'm, I've gotten bad at it for some reason. 
Actually, it's, it's it's really refreshing using Bloom and a actually working on the first try. Huh. I pray for your swift growth, Konohana. Hmm? What do you want with us? Hey, Gramps. Still tearing up the dance floor, I see. So, what happened to the sacred tree? It, g it got so small all of a sudden. Someone put a curse on it, or what? What are you talking about, you fool? I'm lovely, lovingly raising this seedling to bring peace to the land. It shall drive away Orochi and all of his minions. Orochi? <laughs> Where in the world have you been, Gramps? That sneaky snake's been pushing up daisies right about now. I don't have time for this nonsense, you fool. Year after year, you come to our village to claim the sacrifice. And this time you have even learned to speak. Well, today is the day I say enough is enough. Whoa, settle down there, Gramps. We don't want you throwing out your back or anything. Silence, you foul beast. Today's the day I say as an enough is enough. Kung Pao. Hurakapa. I guess his he broke his vow of temperance again. S stupid, <laughs> stupid old man. How dare you? It's not like you're in charge of your own life or anything. You can break your vow of temperance if you want. I won't stop you. Maybe I will. Maybe this time I'll... Take a stand. Okay, is there any, anything up here? No? Because we can easily, easily read. Oh wow, this is a, this is thing. We have not been Kamiki since I don't I don't think we have since we got our double jump. Look how easy it is. It's insane. Okay, so let's go and bloom this stuff because it's it's become unbloomed. Come on, bloom. Thank you. Man, I really have gotten rusty at this, and it's giving us it's giving us a piddling amount of praise. It's giving like two. Got bloom both. Yes, it did. Okay, let's go off. No, we can't go off here. I don't want to enter the village yet. I just want to leave here, run across the water, and see. Yeah, yeah, there it is. Okay, I, I was sure that there were some secrets here, and I was right. And that, that hole is not lined up at all. Thirty praise. We're, we might be able to upgrade our thing soon. Well, fifty praise is hardly soon, but you know what I mean. Okay, so there are people up at this hour. I don't think there are normally. Can we still get... Wait. Wait a minute. What happened to Miss... Oh, there's a chest there, but... Oh, there it is. Okay, there's this, there's this thing. I was wondering if the orange is there, because all this stuff is different. Oh, and by the way, there... Oh, never mind. I shouldn't mention that. That's spoilers. Sorry. I have to remember there are those of you who have yet to play this game. And do we get food from that? Yes, we get we get oranges. We get Konohana oranges. Okay, the the woman's still in the thing. Hmm? You don't fool me, you dumb wolf. Pretending to come sniffing out a sacrifice for Orochi. All the time you you're just waiting to dig up my field. Huh? Give me a break, lady. I've got too much on my mind as it is. Oh, she's gonna she's hitting us. Why are you hitting us? You're not supposed to hit us. We settled our differences. It Something is definitely up. Something is wrong. Hey, sweetie, how you doing? I can hope you can cut that Susano some slack. He's so shy that... What was that all about? Hey, you're Shiranui. We don't need any of Orochi's familiars around here. Shiranui? Orochi's familiar? Does that have to, something to do with our slang Orochi? <laughs> well, you're gonna have to wait in line for an autograph. Shut up! The only one who's gonna get slain is you, you monster! Monster? What's gotten into you, Mushi? Oh, he's hitting us too. Why are you hitting us? Huh. Keep blooming this, these things. Shouldn't forget to bloom these, these because they're... it's free. And I should also check secrets, because apparently the stuff that we've got before has resurfaced. Is no Conan Blossom? Okay, really? What about over there, up there? Is that a thing anymore? Or is that is that gone now? No, it's, it's here again. It's here. And we'll go over there in a second. And ultimately over there. So the secrets have been redispersed. Houses are different. Um, if you look at Mr. Orange's house, it's it's different. 
it's not as big as it used to be, and um, things are just all around different. I will, I will no longer make the assumption that this is Kamiki anymore, or at least the same Kamiki that we know. Tonight is the night of the full moon. That sad day is once again upon us. This year, the lovely young Yami will be Orochi's next victim. Lovely young Yami? Nami? Wow, she sounds hot. Where's she at? Hmm? Oh my, is that Sh 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 Shiranui? Please, I'm begging you. Have mercy on me. I'll make you some yum yummy cherry cakes. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say, Grandma. Now, what about that lovely young y Nami you were talking about? And she actually did give us cherry cakes. What What else should... Oh, there's more. What else does she have to say? Oh my, is that Shishir Nui? Oh, she says the same thing. Okay. And she... Actually. <laughs> She's obviously scared of us, but... Oh wait, oh, we just filled it up. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Thank you for filling up my stomach. I've, I've had the same full stomach since the beginning of the LP. Those old cherry cakes are probably getting a bit, uh... A bit moist. Not crisp, just moist. Oh. Well. Someone's in Susana's yard sleeping. It has to be Su Bloom. Let's go. Eleven praise, because we bloomed all the trees in Kamiki. Huh. Let's wake him up. Zzz. I am the greatest. <laughs> Pops hasn't changed a bit. What the? Huh? Ah, I slept like a log. I must have dozed off while training to defeat that no-good Shiranui. Hmm? Who are you? And what do you want with me? I'm Nagi, the greatest warrior ever. Wait a minute. you you you're... Shiranui? You still dreaming or something, Pops? I mean... Greatest warrior ever? Give me a break. You brought along a little pea-sized monster this time. Well, I have you now, Shiranui, you monster. Monster? Come on, Pops, uh, wake up. You must be still dreaming. And what's with this Shiranui business? You still obsessed with the past? The past, stop speaking nonsense. Look at the moon. Tonight is the night when the moon waxes to its fullest. It marks the day when Orochi shall claim his human sacrifice. Orochi? Wait a second. What's going on? This sinister air. That jerk Orochi must be stirring. How is that possible? Hmm. Too late to feign incense, Shiranui. We know you come each year to size up Orochi's human sacrifice. But this time, things are going to be a bit different. I, Nagi, shall put an end to your de devilish work. Orochi? Nagi? No, it can't be. Right, Ami? I mean, the Spirit Gate couldn't have possibly sent us back to... Kamiki Village 100 years in the past, could it? It all makes sense now. Everything we've seen thus far is made clear. This is Nagi, an opponent we've never faced before, and he's not exactly the, the bad guy we've come to be used to fighting. So, right off, I actually would like to swap out my weapons. While resurrection beads would be nice, I want the same type of attack bonus from having dual glaives equipped. Uh, I do not want to equip any battle items other than Thieves' Glove, as it will prove a bit useful in this fight. There, that being done, we can see his first attack. He will summon five swords that you can reflect back at him, and they will stun him. However, you have to stun all of them back to do so. Line them up, power slash them. Actually, no, they won't stun him. My information was wrong. Uh, he is mostly immune to, uh, to the Celestial Brush technique, so he'll be mostly useless. Wow, I got hurt. Snap. Uh, but, however, there's one technique that will face him, and that is Thieves' Glove, as it will penetrate most defenses and give us a weapon, technically a weapon, that we can use. Um, you want to stay up close and personal with him most of the time, 
and be ready to dodge when when necessary. Um, Veil of Mist is very useful, as it will allow you to see his, his attacks a long time coming. Now, about what's actually happening right now in the story. It all makes sense. The, guard the Guardian Sapling is indeed a sapling right now. It is not the Konohana tree. And... That couple that we, the the travelers that we met at the tree, were the ones that planted it. They were the ancestors of Camille and Camellia, who we pr who we helped prove that Amaterasu was who she was. Uh oh, you knocked him out cold. Wonder what's going on. I mean, he keeps calling himself Nagi. I thought he was Susano. Then again, he looks just like the statue of Nagi in the village. Hmm, that vibe in the village, and the villagers' reactions. And now this big old full moon. Now I'm positive. We really did go back to Kamiki Village 100 years in the past. I get it now. Everybody thought Shiranui came to the village before the festival to size up the next sacrifice. They thought Shiranui was Orochi's familiar or something. So that's why he called you Shiranui, and wanted to fight you. Hey, wait a second. Where's the real Shiranui then? Uh-oh. I have a bad feeling about this. I just hope our coming here hasn't totally messed up history. Hmm? Look, the villagers are all gathered in front of his house. Nagi, please come out. We need your help. Shiranui once again roams our village. It seeks to size up Orochi's next victim. The moon is at its fullest tonight. And the dreaded Orochi... Their cursed arrow has marked the home of the Chosen Maiden. This will be the 100th Maiden since this terrible rite began. Must our village suffer such tragedy yet again? Poor Nami, to think we'd end up having to send you to that beast. I believe in you, Nagi. You have trained long and hard to slay the dreaded Orochi. I shall not lose faith. I'm not afraid to face Orochi in the Moon Cave. I know you will put an end to Orochi and this dreadful rite. I'm going to change into the white sacrificial robe. Please, everyone, go hide in your homes. It is not safe out here. Yule? I took some damage, but 50,000 yen is a nice boost to my wallet. Ugh, that Orochi. I'm sick of him and his antics. Hmm? Hey, wait. Maybe it isn't such a good idea knocking Nagi out like that. I mean, what about the legend? You know, the legend says that Nagi disguised himself as the maiden to be sacrificed, and then slew the dreaded Orochi. But how's he going to do that if he's out cold right now? This is going to change history itself. What are we going to do? We, we'll have to look for Lika later. We got to think of something quick. Hmm. Well, I guess we should make sure things go just like in the legend. That means we'll have to dress o Nagi up like a maiden. Now then, where to begin? Oh, I know. 
Nagi said she was going to change into a white sacrificial Nabi, Nami, sorry, into a white sacrificial robe. We gotta swipe that robe and put it on Nagi, then get him over to Orochi's place. That should be more or less. That should more or less fulfill the legend. At least I hope it will. Anyway, we better hurry before Nami takes off. Let's go swipe that white sacrificial robe. It appears that we've become the enemy. I know it's it's really un in unexpected, but. Amaterasu is seen as Orochi's assistant. It's horrible. We, we gotta set things straight. Hold on a sec. Look at that, Ami. That's Nami. She's bathing in the, in the lake. And look, the white sacrificial robe's there for the taking. Hey, what's with the glowing barrel of sake? You think it could be that eight purification sake? Keep it down, furball. Nami must be purifying herself before putting on the robe. Pretty noble of her, considering Orochi's going to gobble her up. I bet it's her devotion that made the legendary 8 purification sake. If I could just get an up-close view of her like this, I'd... I'd... <laughs> anyway, this is our big chance, Ami. Let's snag her white sacrificial robe while she's busy bathing. You ready? This does not seem like a good idea for, um, Isun's sake, but, uh, we'll give it a shot. Um, Eek! Help! Someone help! Sure know he's prowling about the village again! What in the world was that, you numbskull? You gotta be more careful! You gotta walk up slowly and silently. Then, once you're close enough, snatch the robe. Okay. Eh. Eh. Is this slow enough? I don't think I can go any slower. Can I... Can I power... Can I power slash her? I can! <laughs> oh my word, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry guys. Okay, let's let's try that again. <laughs> I can actually power slash her. Actually, what happens if I do it from here? Oh, I can. It's insane. Oh wait, they're... They're chests down there. Snap. Wait. No! How am I... How am I gonna get the treasure? Wait. Can I use... Okay, this is wasting time, but can I use... Oh, I can. Maybe? I mean, it shows as being a thing. If I use this... Go to that chest! You soon? Chest. Oh, man. Oh, man. That stinks. Okay. Let's, let's do this for real, though. Walk up. Sneak up slowly. Bite. Turn around. Walk away. Walk away. Walk away. Walk away! Way to go, Ami! The white sacrificial robe is ours. Now, let's go get that Nagi into the thing. Ants in her mouth, yeah! Robes in our mouth! And also sake with the robes, because they they go hand in hand. It's like a dr it's like unlike a smoking jacket, it's a drinking jacket. Okay, we got a crystal. I'm really hoping that once we get this robe on on Nagi, we can we can go get the, those chests, because otherwise that's bad. Also, we need to go do that. I need to remember. Okay, we got the robe. Now all we got to do is get pops in here into it. How on earth does that fit? <laughs> Doesn't he look pretty? Now, Nagi can pretend to be the maiden sent to be sacrificed. This should be just like the legend says. Right, Ami? Not bad if I say so myself. Anyway, let's get on with it. Let's get him over to the moon cave before he wakes up. After all, he's all dressed like... Like, uh, he's all dressed up for his date with destiny. Yeah! Kushi's ride, except it's... It's... Nagi's ride. He's riding, but before we do that, we have to bloom some clovers, because uh, we already know the outcome of, of Orochi. He's going to die and stuff, but we, we have to get praise, because that's that's not written in the history books yet. Okay, let's zoom out. Chests, no. Chest, yes, there's a chest back here. Okay, so we've done this before. We have, um, we've brought Orochi, I mean, we've defeated Orochi, Orochi before, so it should be cake, right? I mean, this is in the past. He must be weaker. Uh, no. He's not. So, we're going to have a tough time here. But we should be able to pull it out. 
But man, it is it is so good. We traveled back 100 years into the past, and you know things have changed. It's not identical. Um, for example, the K9 warrior, uh, what was his name? Hayabusa is not a thing anymore. And it just it's amazing that you know all of this has changed. We're seen as the bad guy, um, and we're seeing all of this stuff unfold, setting up for our own debut later, 100 years after this, um, almost 100 years after this date. We will be ending up right by that tree talking to Sakuya, who at this moment is a little girl with a lisp. Yeah, and then the the family planting the trees all across Nippon is right over there. We we discovered that we discovered their ancestors just recently in Seon City, and they had been visiting all of their trees. And it's just it's it's insane to see the ties here. Okay, um I bl I know that if you go talk to um Nami, she says something funny. What are you doing, Shiranui there? I, I skip past some of the text, but... Stop messing around like that, Ami. History's gonna get all mixed up if you don't do this right. Yeah, we can go around talking to people. Um, I'll talk to one person. I'll just talk to one. Just one. Go talk to the people in uh, Mr. Orange's house. Get in there. Here they are. And one person's trying to beat us, one person's trying to run away. Let's talk to... Can we talk to one of them? No? Mr. Grapefruit, you foul beast. They don't say anything about this? Really? Okay, let me hit her. Oh my, have mercy on me. They're scared for their lives because they think that we are with Orochi. Ha, huh, man. Okay, so let's go. Um, I guess this, well, I'll go to Sh Shinchu Field. I'll, I'll fulfill that much. Except that we have a merchant right here, which I should probably stock up now that I have some of the funds to do so. That perfect white coat, those razor sharp eyes. You, you must be sure, Nui. Wah, someone help me. I don't taste good. No, no. I'd be a terrible sacrifice. What in the world? He thinks you're going to eat him or something. Hmm. He does look kind of plump. I'm, I'm as plump as a dumpling, but I'm poisonous. Yes, poisonous. Well, look, I'll sell you anything you want, but please spare me. Sure, I'll shop with you. <laughs> Suddenly the music's gone. We're just conducting some business. And no, 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 no. He's not He's not saying I'll give you anything you want. He's just like, I'll sell stuff to you. Oh, wow. This guy carries three of the weapons that we have. Three of our most recent weapons. All tier... Yeah, all tier four, um, tier four equipment he's selling, which is really cool. Uh, other stuff. We could use feed bags. We haven't had a feed bag in a while. Um, no, I'm not gonna buy anything. Do I need that? No, I don't. I don't need anything. We're good. We're good. Let's go. Shinshu Field. 100 years in the past. So, this is Shinshu Field 100 years ago. Hey, you've. You've given a piggyback ride to the Moon Cave before, but it was that babe Kushi last time. The view, not to mention smell, was a whole lot better then. I'm not sure I'm liking this whole back to the, going back to the past thing. And I'm back. Uh, off screen, I took the opportunity to save because I needed to. Um, I have to. I have to mention that you definitely want to save before progressing anywhere in this area. I'll pr I will tell you why uh, when it comes up, but first I want to bloom these trees. There it is. And these trees. There. So, we can actually explore Shinshu Field right now. It is a little bit different from when we were first there here. And, with the new area comes new enemies. These are the... Clay Soldier and Clay Samurai. These are clones of the Green Imp and Red Imp, respectively, and also the Namahaje, Blade Namahaje, and all of the like. Uh, right off, you want... I didn't mean to do that. You want to use uh, Veil of Mist, as it will allow you to attack the enemies. Now, they are powered up, but they are not, not that powerful. You can actually do a lot of damage to them, and I missed their Flora Finchers. Wonderful. I don't know why we're doing so much... Oh, why am I using that Floral Fincher? It's that. Um, and they will yield a lot of demon fangs. Oh, I did that too. I twitched. Snap. That was a great battle. Let me show you a different one because that was horrible. 
Um, something I should note. Let's enter another battle so I can show this off. Uh, Demon Scroll, hey. I need you. Thank you. This is actually a fantastic place to grind. It is the best... Really? This is the best... Come on, let me kill you. Thank you. And you're dead. This is the best place in the game to grind. Like, no joke, it is. You get so much money from these battles that it just, you know, it it's not even, like, a contest. 8,000 yen for a couple seconds, and I believe some of the battles give you a lot more. Um, let me let me go in some of these, because I remember this is the place in the game where I started grinding. This is uh, another, this is another play soldier. Uh, let's go ahead and blot it. Does the blotting it work, please? Yes, it did. Okay. Let's finish you off. Strategy's just the same as the yellow imp. I... No, no, no. I believe this is the floral finisher. Yes. And just for that one battle, it gives us... Some yen and 10,000 yen. There it is. One enemy, 10,000 yen. And you can just keep doing this in a cycle. And it's... It's not, it's never ending, because when you're done, you can just go in Kamiki Village and come back out. And, you know, they're surprisingly weak for how much they give you. And they give you a decent amount of Demon Fangs that is just totally worth it to grind here. Like, look at this. Okay, battle done maybe 20 seconds, and it gives us 8,000 yen. And just keep doing this, and just keep doing this, and just keep doing this, and you'll get so much money. Not to mention the money you're getting from just defeating the enemies. So yeah, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a little bit more battles. There's another. I'm showing all the uh, these stat things. I'll, also, this guy gives us like yeah three. So there's a lot of a lot more yen and twenty thousand yen. There's a much better example. One enemy, twenty thousand yen. Let's see if we can top that. Uh, there's an iron rock here, which I should definitely take care of. Like why wouldn't I? And is the is the dojo over there? That's a good question. Is is the dojo over there? Forty praise. Thank you. Oh, and that's another thing. You should be getting anything you want done here in the past uh, while you're in the past, because once you leave, you can never come back. Let's go ahead and kill you. I kill you. Oh, and yeah, power slash. You. What do you have to say? You have nothing to say because you are dead. You are dead too. What about you? Would you like to be dead? Yay, you died too. We don't honestly need Demon Fangs anymore, but yeah, it's, it's a bonus. So for that battle we get 12,000 yen. There you go. So will I be grinding off of this? Will I? Yes. Yes, I actually will be grinding off this. Not a whole lot, but it's something I do want to take advantage of. Um, because the Devil Gate Trial Cave is coming up, and I need a lot of equipment for that, because that probably, it's probably going to take upwards of one to two hours, and I need to be as prepared as I can for, for such a thing, so, yeah, I will be grinding off this off-screen in between episodes, because this episode is over as soon as we are done exploring, uh, Shinshu Field. There's a lot of praise to be had in this area, a lot of money to be had, and a lot of exploration to ex explore. Oh yeah, but also, I need to tell you to save before you enter this this area, and you know why? Because, for some reason, um, this part of the game likes to freeze. It will freeze on you. Um, it's I think it's happened to me once, and I know some other people who it's happened to, so you want to, you want to be doing, you want to be saving. Let's see, this area, this is where the Konohana sapling was before. I don't know what's here now. Nothing. Just nothing in this, okay. But the Konohana sapling is not here anymore. So yeah, I believe that's all of the praise. Oh wait, no, no, there's another iron rock with more, with more praise. Let's do that, and then we can actually pro. I think we can. Can we go that far? I thought I saw. No, okay, I didn't see the bridge. Uh, yeah, we can't actually go beyond half of the half of the map. Half of it, it just isn't there. I don't know why, um, maybe it didn't exist at the time, that's entirely possible. Um, maybe a volcanic eruption created it, I don't know. But all I do know is that it is not there at the moment, and places where the path would have continued are just 
gone, and there are there are stray be and there are um, there are clovers here. I'm not sure if I've mentioned that, but there are in fact no stray beads in this area. No sun fragments, no stray beads, no collectibles that are important to the story. Uh, so don't don't worry about that. Just worry about the praise, which there's a ton. We've gotten about 300 praise, going on 340, just from this area alone. So uh, yeah, it's it's giving us a lot of praise here. 40 more praise and another clover. Will the clovers ever stop? We might be able to, if this contains 60 praise, which I doubt it, we'll be able to upgrade something. 60? No, 30. Okay. I'm content. I get, we got 370 praise almost entirely this episode. And I'll probably be running around during the end slate making sure that there aren't more clovers that I'm missing. So that's going to be it for this episode. Next time, we're going to be heading to the moon cave with Nagi. This is an unexpected turn, but... Uh, we will hopefully save the day since we have yet to see Shiranui. Who knows? Maybe we are the Shiranui from the legend. Maybe that Shiranui was the Shiranui from the future traveling to the past. You never know. But I will see what we'll find out then. Uh, I release new episodes of Okami Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Saturdays are long episodes. And if you like this episode, then comment. If you didn't like this episode, then comment and tell me how I can make next episode so that you would like it. Um, in the end slate, I will be grinding off enemies. But I might be doing a bit more... Well, how on earth did I miss this? But I might be doing a, a bit more grinding um, beyond the end slate. Okay. I'm going to end it here. See you guys next time.